the most dynamic drafting we've seen from Kuro at any tournament. I mean, if it's not broken, don't fix it, Toby, huh? Not yeah, enough that doesn't work against magical damage. Oh, this is difficult for mind control. Uh, right, he's going to get double creep waves. Uh, maybe he could just never ending spin onto Roger, but that won't happen. They can sustain in this lane. Oh, there's going to be extra gold. Nope. Is she fortifying up the creep wave, Roger? Oh, he's so low on life. The battle hunger is going to kill him off. Moving up, Ramsey's just like, hey, can you do something about this? No, I can't do anything. Didn't need much more, just a, an easy hold. And into a spin, we'll stop from Pasha. This is GH getting a little bit more aggressive with the Splinter Blast. GH comes so much damage. He's got Salve available. We need that extra distance. So now he can give the life over to Miracle with Rocket Barrage moving forward. Splinter Blast will cancel off the heal, but Pasha getting blocked in the trees. And then Miracle having the same problem. He doesn't need he the stun. He doesn't connect on GH. The Duke around the trees will not help. Miracle end up killing off Pasha. Like, how do they stop this? Weha can just keep power shotting and destroying the wave. So at least it slows down the push of this first dragon form. Um, but bottom lane, mind control. Well, he's got the taunt over. Needs some extra spins. And oh. GH! <gasps> he doesn't get the life, but he's got the balls! And he'll give those. With the extra brain with the extra brain set available from Kuro, they should be able to get this kill onto the support. And Roger, body blocked up. GH's rotation almost saving mind control. But oh. it ensures a double kill for GH, and that's that early start. So Roger and Solo looking to work together to kill off Miracle. He has level 6, Miracle sees him, TP's coming in, Miracle lets the cooldown go, wants to catch out Roger, Solo caught by the, the uh, first rocket, second rocket won't connect with the flat cannon damage, Pasha has to move forward to take it for the team, but he's actually shackled up, Weeha using the neutral centaur to hold him in position, Solo has died in the meantime because Weed's already picked up that kill, Pasha wants to deny himself to the Alpha Wolf, but he won't have it! We won't have anything with that double kill for the rotation off of the Wind Ranger. Looks like uh, DK's on that, not going to stick around for this. Ramses will go into a spin. Uh, Mind Control going to try and spin TP out. It will not be successful. Ramses has enough damage to get through. More obvious with the way they ended. But this one still feels good. Ramses runs up. It's a Fiend's Group combining with a call down. VP do not want to walk into this. So much damage. Juggernaut's already gone down. They have to use the Stampede to escape. GH is even lucky enough. Arcane Rune, bottle it up and get forward. The homing missile's coming. No one will have to fight underneath the shrine. He's already burned it. The liquid have more than enough damage to keep going through this DK. And There's who's meant to be immortal? Latch him to a tree. I just can't believe VP fought into a place where they had no vision. Yeah. Like they just spent time putting vision on the northern side. Now Solar reveals himself inside the trees. Um, yep, Courier turn the opposite direction because that Wyvern is dead. Liquid is playing so fast right now. Double TP is coming towards the top lane. Mass open was already committed. Weeha will get the shackle and they're relocating GH and Miracle in. So they'll get rid of Roger up that quickly. Winter Vibrant can also buy one, but it's only a position five Winter Vibrant and he's not gonna oh, get the only farm. Slash. Kuro, he's gonna nightmare. There's gonna waste so much of this. And he's still got Fiend's Grip available. That's why Rams went to the spin. Kuro will end up stealing. Oh, he's getting the Fiend's Grip off. He has enough life thanks to the mech that got brought in by GH. You'll get the Ether Shock, but that now means that Roger's gonna fall. You get the revenge kill on Kuro, sure. But actually, no, you don't. The neutral creep kill Kuro. It wasn't even the bloody hero. Virtus Pro don't get the credit for it, and they're gonna lose their support. Sorry, it's no one this time, not Ramses, but okay. The DK just walked into the pit underneath the oh, dire they might saw that. They, they totally they... saw that. Like, waiting under the cover of smoke. Liquid is ready. Soul is a little bit further up. The power shot sees information. The mass up ones are already down inside the pit. Everyone's TP'd over from Liquid. So prepare yourselves for a fight. The blink in, the blink axe call. They need to kill off this winter wife before any kind of curse can happen. The shackle holds him to the trees. Roshan, he's not dead yet. He's one fifth miracle under the cover of his own BKB. Moves forward, force them out. And you know what they're going to try and do? They're going to finish Roshan. Run at the mass serpent wards. No one walks in. He's nine man up. They'll break it free. On these sides, it's out. Roshan killed by the dire. Snatched the Aegis Wall into the hands of Pasha. But Mind Control's already got the double kill with the shackles. They can hold Miracle in position. But now the chase begins for Team curse. Liquid. Pasha up the hill. Gyrocopter is the one being cursed up, but Weeha with BKB protection shackled Ramsey's killed him off and they go from one to the other. You can kill off Pasha, he'll break the Aegis Immortal but Mind Control has himself a triple kill. Miracle is unstoppable and Pasha can TP away. So if they call GG, it, they GG, call it. 23 minutes in, Virtus Pro. You know what? Like, yeah, it's pretty good. Uh, hey, at least Virtus Pro looked happier. They came back in and there was some smiles. But the next level plays, you don't skill it if DB comes to your lane. Oh, Miracle. He's real low, but he's going after Pasha, working with Koro. They've actually got the kill. 
Out of all of this, just kept burning off all the mana. The Splinter Blast will connect on Miracle. He doesn't have level two, so he'll have to blink away. But Roger slowed up. He doesn't have enough damage to get through the trees. Kuro wants to stay with this one. Miracle hit level two. He can blink in and actually secure the kill on Roger. That's exactly what he does. He dodges the split. What a player. And he actually gets the double kill. Pasha, he wants Kuro. The Anchor Smash range is ridiculously big, so he'll find that kill and maybe back to back champion Pasha if he can kill yeah. off Miracle. Okay. Some really juicy stacks from GH, both oh. Anti Mage or TA. Can remove mm -hmm. those. Pasha's still not level six and uh, doesn't even have mana at this point. Oh, wow. Blink four from Miracle. Realizes all alone. Realizes a little too late. Solo's there. Begins the TP out. The damage output. It will be enough. And you got Annie Mage who's looking to control uh, inside the die jungle on the northern side. But here goes Mind Control again over on Ramsey's. Four sticky napalm charges, but he sunders his illusion. The lasso is out. And Ramsey's, well, he's going to burn through this. Mind Control's taking so much damage from Roger. And Roger will be able to at least get the rebuttal while Pasha, RP, they're trying to cancel and burn off enough mana so he cannot ravage. He uses the one charges, gets the ravage off, supports moving over in the form of the Ember Spirit. No one will want to commit hard towards this, but not on a miracle. He wants a support kill, something he can claim, which is Kuro's life. The Shockwave pulls him back down again, but Kuro will die once again. Solo will claim this kill. Mag is not... We, like the playmaking for we in a little he, bit of trouble he brought dust roger so we are instantly revealed ramsey's wanting to push in towards the tower and how many times must they get back-to-back -back kills with solo just charging forward once again the splinter blast will slow down kuro plus 16 on the intelligence stolen mm -hmm. kuro's still taking a sweet time to come out like it's been holding on to that item for a couple of seconds but now it's moving Looks like it had uh, Weeha's Desolate to deliver. Ramsey's again, always having that illusion nearby with the Global Silence out. Bat Rise on the run, but the Searing Chains will hold him there. So there's the big multi. Control and Kuro with the Shockwave from GH. They'll get the kill over on Ramsey's. You have Magnus RP. Bring them together. Three to work. And now the Ravage can pop. But Kuro got so much damage out that Weeha couldn't get there in time. The Ravage created the extra space. And even the Sata works against him with the Searing Chains as well. Roger will get up the hill and away. Miracle! The damage always killed both Pasha and Solo, but they both barely survive. That Dolby. would have been huge. Oh, hey, usually GH. <laughs> oh, they found him. <laughs> it's a, well, Shockwave at least slows down the wave. He's going to try and TP out to safety, but it will not happen. You're just going to deal damage with some kind of a cleave, any AoE damage, and he's going to be able to pop the rabbit. Curse is out. Koro. He's waiting for the extra stun to be committed. Silence is going to arrive as well. No global silence available. Does he want to let it go? Right on top of the Winter Wyvern. They've got to get in range of him. But Kuro, he's, can't, he's going to kill off Roger. Roger, this cold embrace is not protecting from the freezing field. You would think that would actually not work. But hey, this is not physics. Kuro will go down. No one has a double kill. Ember Spirit in RP. He just dies if he's on the other for side a target. of the map. They found Silencer. He's trying to actually get the D ward out. A quick Silence. Get the quick kill. He can buy back and glip the global, give the global Silence. Exactly what ends up happening. BKB already been triggered. And this has the Silence Miracle caught flat-footed. Even the curse. There's a the huge Ravage. Hit. The Ravage will pop. They have no way to get back out of this one. Now it's going to be four heroes down from Team Liquid. And uh, this is a huge problem. This is Liquid right now. This <laughs> is a financial problem for Liquid. The bang! Oh! That's not what you wanted. So Weeha's trap won't see much in the pit. Mind Control into the Firefly. Getting the extra information. GH can still skewer forward. Pasha trying to keep Mind Control away. A quick curse. Weeha's moving in under the cover of Refraction. They're trying to get it. for this one. Who's going to take nice. Roshan? Skewer. Mind Control got it. And they actually killed Roshan. Mind Control is the Aegis Immortal. Kuro starts letting it go. They're taking this entire fight without the Anti-Mage. You did have to die back over on Magnus for it all, as Kuro will die as well. But they stop VP from having the essentials to push high ground. But if they lose Weeha, this will be an absolute catastrophe. Start the reflect the reflection. Weeha blinks up. He was actually being protected. Now, now Miracle joins comes. the fight. They've taken away all the mana of Ramses. He doesn't have any one charges available either. So they have to push him down the hill and far away. Weeha with a mana, mana void. The is spilled out towards Solo. A blink forward. He's protected by the spell block. As Weeha, he wants to kill over on Pasha. The turn around. But they only break the Aegis, the model of mind control while Miracle. Again, jumping in aggressively. Pasha need to keep burning off this mana. Make sure he's got nothing, but they don't actually stop him from being able to blink away. He blinks the other way, however. He blinks further up towards the dire side of the jungle. I don't know if this is meant to be a sacrifice or not, but Pasha will end up dying. A TA trap to slow him down. Miracle only two hits. Okay, maybe with Anchor Smash, three hits. Meta is running out. There's no global. Animage wants to get into the back lines. Miracle's looking for it. 
but you got the melee rack, so V's, VP, all they need to do is get out Miracle. He just jumps forward, the spell shield is up, into the TA traps, getting all kind of slow. He wants to burn the mana before he can get the mana void out, but now Miracle, he's so low on life, he but has he's still G's. consisting forward. Remember, you've got the Ravage, the BKB is up, the jump in, now they can get the spell damage. Miracle with the mana void, Ramses and Solo will die. The curse creeps, but Miracle, he jumps in, he avoids the curse, which means they won't lose their support. GH jumps forward, getting the extra slow as Roger will fall dead for a minute and a half. And Miracle could be very protected if he goes high ground, or Weeha. We actually even seen, like, really the presence of Weeha as his eyes have been on Miracle. But they will take this mid racks very quickly, and buybacks from Virtus Pro, they're available on everyone but the Wyvern. And look at Animage. Miracle, he wants more. He wants the Creep Wave, as well as the extra tier 3 tower. Ravage, being burned, catching up four. Can they kill him? They did! Miracle's already gone down, a huge spree to be ended by no one, and Liquid are in full retreat. The Spirit jumped forward, Sansa is brought back in. And they'll find this kill on Kuro. The tier three tower will fall. They know they burn fortification to try and defend their mid lane. A team liquid. Will they be happy to let another wave go? Ravage is down. Global Science is down. The lasso. Animage will buy it back, but you've got the root. Batrider cannot move away. Now Kuro wants to let it go, but it's difficult. He can't actually get the uh, right position for it, but Mind Control protected by the GH's Lotus Orb. They're still trying to get him all the way back to base. The range racks has been taken, but Miracle. Where is his influence of the fight? Jumps in, gets the instant bash over on the Terra Blade. The There's Hex a Hex. As well. They're trying to focus him down. They've got at least a curse, but it's only Another keeping, bash. keeping TA out. And Randy's, he'll sunder the life away from Solo, giving him the way to fight. But GH hits the RP as well. Weeha needs to be able to connect, but the cold embrace. Koro letting it go! All over! But as pro, Randy's has to come back in. In range, do some level of damage to kill off Koro, but Miracle is not dying! Koro just doing everything! A double kill for him! The Shockwaver won't reach Roger. Moving Trap. around, the TA yeah, He's down, making sure that they have the extra vision. Then the Mel Strife from Weeha to put Roger down. Oh you, my god, Antimage is going to pick up the Bounty Rune and the Beth Rider will have enough for a buyback. Yep, so he can come up. GH has RP available. They'll have to really lock everybody in together and they'll need Miracle. Smoke up. Can they do this defense without Weeha? Without their newest recruit team, Liquid Pass just looking for it. Remember, he's got the Refresher shot. He hasn't triggered it just yet. Solar Crest first. Wait for that Ravage. The tier 4 towers, they're being taken down. Mind Control can't find the angle of initiation. Miracle jumped into the back lines. He's in pretty damn deep. The lasso, they actually found the TB. GH is still waiting as Koro lets it out. They've killed off the Winter Wyvern. They're taking care of the back lines. The RP, no! The Ravage, it cancelled it! GH couldn't get it off in time! He won't get anything out now! Miracle, he may have found a double kill on the back lines, but now he'll lose his final support. Who has buyback available for Miracle? He's got no life. The tier 4 towers have been taken, the fortress is going That's down, they and this should be close. the game. Miracle's not going to give it up, but they're calling GG. It's done. 41 22. Absolutely a crap. Hard up, monkey game, though. You get purged, it will remove your Jingo. One boundless strike from no one will not be enough to kill off Weeha. Oh, Pasha. Koro actually getting that kill on bottom lane. Move their supports to the top lane. Looking for their own fight into mind control. TP support is coming in from the clockwork. I don't know if he wants to complete that, but he kind of has to. GH arrives with a double damage rune. Kuro and Weeha are trying to go into no one, but it's top lane where clockwork is currently dying. And just the damage output combining with the god strength. He's pinging that there's a, an observer ward, but the, there's actually not. Mm -hmm. Kuro will TP Obviously bottom. Slash. Pick up some XP. No one's in trouble. The TA trap's got a trigger as well. Just that extra bit of a slow in damage. GH is arriving. Roger, the fidget block actually keeps Weeha around, but doesn't keep Miracle spin out. As Roger, the battery assault, he's trying to get one totem stun down. The TA trap controls the other end. Now he can get the double stun and move out of the trees, but the Mel Strike will still connect. The chain off will be Ramsey's to find the kill into the back lines to kill off GH. Pasture has died as well. Ramsey's in a world of hurt underneath the tower. Miracle just wants to get the hell out of here, or does he? Healing water's they being planted. Trap. They can actually stand with the trap. The slow is good, but the double stun from Ramsey is better. They can move under the tower, but it's buying time for TP support to arrive from Virtus Pro. It's the balance strike connects GH. He's going to try and cog create his space, trapping up no one inside the cogs. He can't push back out again, and Miracle uses the spin to come in closer. No one with that balance strike. He's got all the lifesteal ready to go. He needs to hit somebody. Finally, Weeha's in range. Refraction will buy some time. Another TA trap turning for the damage. Five, Five heroes, heroes from, from VP. Pro brought to this mid. Lane. So they don't see the uh, they don't see the observer ward. And the jump forward, the curse over on three. Nice Fidget block. block is good, but Miracle into the spin. Wukong's command is down, and they're kind of trapped here for the moment. Omni Slash is available. Everyone's just trying to disengage. My control will die, but global. Everything apart from the Echo Slam was actually burnt. So Liquid just have to back out and then reset. They only and use fact, four they can, ultis. They can look for the kill in mid. 
<laughs> they only use four ults. Oh, wrong side. They have double oh, fish or nice disruption. save. Kuro of the Storm Hammer can never actually reach his target. Another TA trap and GH, he jumps himself forward on the cock, pushing Ramsey's eyes, letting him from the rest of his team and continuing the poison stack up. But Roger is trapped. Trap. Miracle gets the kill. And do they go up? The lanes are in good position. They're going to go for high ground, at least deal some damage, try to force something to happen. Every ulti is back up for Virtus Pro. A that, lot of attack speed. That's the downside. No one beginning the Wukong's command, but the mind control cutting the trees, revealing where no one was trying to hide. The ball's already doing the work. And the tier three tower is almost dead. We're 17 minutes into the game. Weehan wants to come up and finish the job, but he understands if he gets Fissure blocked in, he could just die twice. No reason to risk it. VP even planning a defensive observer ward right in front of their tower. They need to see as far as they possibly can. God, they want to get this tier 3 tower so oh, they can yeah. get shrines. No one's baiting the Wukong. Here it comes out. Miracle. He actually is in on, on the front lines. Needs disruption. to move out of the Wukongs, but have they got more disruption? It's not there. Yeah, Miracle will silence. die. Ooh. No one wants more. Jumping forward, right on top of GH. Battery Assault is already down. No one kind of isolated with Hogshot forward. No one instantly dead. And that Supernova so far out of position. GH isolates Ramses with the Cogs out on the sides. He's battling inside the mid lane. The TA trap will buy GH a little bit more space to get away. The buyback is already coming from the Monkey King, but Weehan wants to fight. Remember, he's got this Aegis the Immortal. A defensive disruption again from Kuro, making sure it doesn't go to waste. Buyback at this point of the game, but they realize they have nothing to fight with. Roger, I'm not sure if he has a Blink Dagger. Oh, another great fish at the Echo Slam comes out. Roger comes a hell of a lot of damage by that defensive disruption. They want to go on Miracle, but he spins. He'll dodge any other attack, but they just want to get out of this one for the moment. Yes, is down, or do they? Clockwork, hook shots not off cooldown just yet. GH is in a position like he's is about to come off cooldown. No one perched up into the Omni Slash. Totally isolated. He never jumped Share over anyone damage. else. And now the side blade damage spills out across Solo as well as Pasha. The Storm Bolt, where's the control? They at least are able to keep their Rackers alive, but Weeha, so low on life. I think maybe now is the time you want to have that Aegis pop, or it could just hurt Solo! Oh, Lacoste, you call it. Where's your armor? Where's your life? Where's your hope? Where's your top melee racks? It's about to all be in ramp, like, like in ruins. And there's another healing ward. These racks, is, they're gone. Yep. So the Hawk comes up, they see Ramses, the traps are on the sidelines, Roger wants to move around the back lines. A quick curse over on three. Miracle quickly dispels. Now Weeha caught out for the moment. Stunned, they'll use a force off, getting back, but GH found the target. He found Roger over on the sideline. The Roar is down as well. They just want the ES removed. They're able to do so. Buyback's available. The Aegis Mortal is burned over on the Tempo Assassin's Ramses. Turns around to fight once more, looking for some extra damage into Weeha. They may be able to get it all out. Defensive disruption now from Kuro will buy a little bit more time. It's a great fissure. It's a great boundless no strike. Echo, now though. the Icarus dive in, but they're caught into the Wukong's command. Without the Echo, they don't have to control. Mind Control is able to warrant, run himself back further out. Over on the side, GH will create more space, but they're moving into the TA traps. That's a four-man trap. Kuro with this poison. He continues to stack it up. That's way too much on no one. And now with the Melon Strike, he touches the mischief. It's problematic to say the least. While Rams is having his own little battle on the side, Kuro can buy back, but Miracle, he wants to move in deeper. Mind Control getting caught by the curse that may be his own death as Ramsey's. He'll commit one last wave of access so GH can have some level of control in that battle. But Miracle, he wants to buy back, a die back over on Roger. He'll be ice and they're going to claim it. That's a minute without Roger. They're not done. I'm not <laughs> sure if Beastmaster has a buyback. He does. He might actually buy back. All right. It's, yeah. oh, it, they already took the melee axes. They don't have to commit to buybacks. Yeah. They still have every single tier one tower in the game. So even if they buy back, Virtus Pro can't do anything. The Observer and Sentry doesn't see enough. Great hook shot forward. And the four star, he wants the backline cogs. Global Silence doesn't do anything because the BKBs are from Weehaw. They'll kill off Ramses. They hit so hard, so fast. Did someone catch Team Liquid's license plate number? They, they can call this game. There it is. Like GG. They, they have nothing to do. 22 <laughs> minute GG's. Game one and game three. The two games Liquid take off Furnace Pro and they just tap it out. They admit defeat. There's, there's nothing more to be had. 22 minutes, 23 seconds. That's the time to call it. Look at that. They're so happy. You know what? We ha uh, I was wondering too, like Liquid come, they attend this, they needed to have a great roster change that felt like they've got something different yeah. in their team. And like